upgrade it to 0804 firmware of Android 2.1. screen is very responsive I have yet to have a problem with the touch screen a demonstration of uh, 720p video. I have uh, the movie Kick-Ass installed on an SD card. I said, touch is very responsive. This says 720p. plays very well. This is a DivX video playing in real player. It looks far better than it does through the camera that I'm taping it. As I said, touch screen works very well. Very responsive. sample in the movie we could play. So episodes of Criminal Minds also at 720p. Audio is dependent on, I find, uh, on the recording. Some items are much louder than others. The audio for this particular clip is very good. No stuttering. Plays very smoothly. My little boy just turned seven this year. 
the screen, however, uh, is a uh, isn't that great of quality. If you tilt very very little in any direction, you immediately lose a lot of your contrast. to end all my tasks. This is a Sega Genesis emulator. Also works very well. Try out a game. One of my old favorites, Jam and Earl. The lack of uh, multi-touch support really hinders many games. Another classic. Sega Genesis title. Oh, the Hedgehog. Try one of your standard uh, Android games. Also, the same game can be found on the Apple products. Full screen. This game works very well on the Android. Very fast, very smooth. Hold it out of this. Nintendo emulator works very well, also. As you can see, I have a lot of Nintendo games on here. Start, select. The audio is very good on the uh, emulators. The one emulator I've had a problem with working. was the was the Super Nintendo emulator
give you an illustration of uh, ebook reading in Aldico. Dismiss my tips. Pick a book, go to my bookshelf. Select, uh, change the day and night. Text is very smooth. Back to your bookshelf. Select the book. your content a chapter very smooth Guitar Hero 5. I've only been playing around with the tablet for maybe a day or so. Um, the uh, This version of Android still needs a lot of refinement, but uh, other than that, it works perfectly fine for what I paid for it. I have the Wi Fi upstairs is not hooked up at the moment, so let's go back here. Okay. game is full screen. I find that most of the Android applications uh, don't work full screen on any of the tablets. They're specifically designed for the phone. Very difficult to play with one hand. As you can see, this game is a good illustration that the touch indeed works pretty good. Fairly accurate. When I first got the tablet, it wasn't so. But uh, playing around with it. Anyway.